WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman on this Friday, the 25th of October. This is the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. It comes in after the uh, Tommy O'Brien show. This is the morning market kickoff at 9 o'clock. Great programming here throughout the day. Let's go to the Dow. The Dow's up 165 at 42,545. I'm in a technical Friday today for Chapman Wave Methodology. So in my show coming up, I'll discuss the alternate count and why I thought that there was a chance that there'd be a, an alternate count but it doesn't matter. We've pulled back, but that nine-period moving average is still holding really well. I see internal strength, and that's really important. Looking at the S&P, uh, so the Dow at 42,541, the all-time high is 43,325. I think we're going to try to make it towards that level uh, next week. We've got the S&P at 43, at 58.53.70 right now. Uh, very nice action. I was going to draw this in that I completely forgot about. Chapman Wave falling exclamation. Let me just do that right now. There we are. We're breaking out above it. And that's really important. Good. So uh, very nice action. Nine period moving average. Very strong. QQQ up um, one, two, three. There we are. QQQ is trading at four. 199.66. Oh, look, a new recovery high. Fabulous action. Legs see in the weekly chart. I like this. Up seven and a half. Go to the IWM. Also up, up very nicely. Up a dollar uh, oh nine at two twenty point eighty two. Um, up point five one percent. So the uh, the Qs are up one point five. That's very interesting. That's because the semiconductors are doing well. Look at gold. Gold has actually uh, pulled back just a little bit. It's in this high range, uh, high level consolidation, almost at all time highs. The dollar itself is uh, pulling back just a little bit after that peak E. Let's go to bonds because that's really important. Bonds are trying to rally. They're up uh, zero. They're at 118 and 24, 30 seconds, really struggling. Those yields are still much higher. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil right now is up a dollar oh two at 71.21, just stuck in a range. Uh, the 200 period moving average of 72.41 is very strong resistance. Let's go to Bitcoin. Bitcoin is up 685 at 68. 1900. I'll do a little bit more work when we get back. We'll talk about Bitcoin as well. I like what I'm seeing. I'll be right back. Basil Chapman coming up for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call daily newsletter. Had some really nice positions there. I'll be back in a minute. 